We're back again, folks. J Munch Soup, fitness and food. Second dish today. Second dish today. Smoothie time. Smoothie time. Just finished your run. Ridiculously dehydrated, so you need to replenish the carbs and the water in you. I got just a thing. What about a beet, red grape, raspberry, citrus smoothie? Sound difficult? Well, it's not. So let's knock that on out. How about that? All right. We're going to start off with, oh, let's say about, would be two and a half cups, maybe uh, three cups of red grapes. Really, these dimensions are just to your liking. I love the grapes. They add that, the red grapes add a, a great, a good amount of sweetness to this dish, which uh, plays really well with the beans. So we can let those come on in. You can also use black grapes as well. They work well with this dish. Our red beets, just sliced up, raw, just peeled and sliced. Put those in there. Then frozen, and this is the key. Using frozen grass, frozen fresh raspberries. It'll make your whole uh, smoothie, give it a little uh, a cold, frozen little bits, and make it a lot colder. So, drop those in there. Now we're going to move to the small, but the wonderful. Lemon zest. A lot of flavor, a lot of flavors. A couple, a couple pieces of lemon zest. Wonderful. Pink grapefruit zest. Pink grapefruit zest. Wonderful. Great citrus flavor. Ginger. I'm running low on ginger, so I'm using two last pieces, but medicinal, medicinal use for ginger helps out the immune, helps strengthen the immune system. Definitely what you want to roll with. And green tea. Gotta have it. Now you can use regular water in here. You can use fruit juice. Now, you can use fruit juice. The only thing is you're adding calories to it. This is water, zero calories. Uh, plus, you have a green tea. Again, it helps the immune system, strengthen the immune system, and all the other great things that the green tea does to you. And it's organic. All right. So I'm gonna take, pop that off. And also, what I do is I make my green tea, put it in a container, then freeze it. And you have ice green tea to use for it, just like this. Pour it on in. Actually, I'm not gonna fill it all the way with water because I want the the weight of the the, uh, the contents to help a grind the, the grind the smoothie up a little bit more. And then I can finish it off with a little bit of water as I go. The color of this smoothie is just so, so wonderful. I'll tell you what, I just thought about something. I'm gonna add one more addition. Because this is what I normally do. And instead of leaving it out, I'm gonna add my protein. Now, I'm not being sponsored, but I didn't bother to tape off the, tape off the label. Uh, I actually love this protein. It's a plant-based protein, plant-headed, plant-headed. Uh, the all, all plant-based. The uh, protein comes from. Let's see. From, uh, it's a great, great product. Vegan product for all you vegans out there, vegetarians as well. Uh, brown rice protein, cranberry. Uh, just, just great stuff in here. I'll, let, I'll, I'll post this up so you can, so you can look at it yourself. But plant head protein, vanilla flavor. Uh, again, with now with smoothies, I always tend to use a vanilla flavor, just because that will allow you to make whatever kind of flavored smoothie you would like. Because the vanilla is pretty much, pretty much plain Jane. You can take your smoothie to whatever directions you want, flavor wise. I'm gonna go with two nice big scoops here. Uh, I did run today, so I already had one. This will be my second smoothie for the day. And it's right on time, I'm telling you. While we're doing this, uh, exactly when this will be posted, very soon is what I'm looking for. But uh, we have a race coming up this weekend, Carla. Hopefully we'll see some of you out there, the H205K.
that's the one for. Red grape, beet, frozen raspberry, ginger, lemon zest, pink grapefruit zest, and green tea. And, of course, the protein, plant hair protein, vanilla flavor. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a smoothie for the ages. If you want to be rehydrated, that's what you want. Me, I'm going to finish this up. Folks, so next time, J Matsu with J Matsu Fitness and Food. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you learned a little something. Uh, smoothie, the apple avocado soup, great for you. Until next time, time to work.